It all started on a Wednesday. By the weekend, everything changed. Should have known when the bees went extinct. Been all over the place. Seen all kinds of crazy. It's pretty much what our world looks like now. Mostly empty. So, I got nobody else to talk to. Oh! I found a working iPod once. Best six hours of my life. My parents sacrificed everything for our survival. I do remember my dad saying something about a virus crossing kingdoms from plant to man. People moved near the oceans because we all heard fish weren't infected. So it made it hard to get food or to keep food. Ten years in, things started to settle back down. I'm one of the lucky ones. A fella came by our place once in need of shelter. Turns out he was mighty ill. Yeah, he passed. But before he did, he gave me this hat and a couple of maps. It said there were treasures, heirlooms he called them, scattered around the US. He said I should find them because they came from a government seed vault. So I'm praying that means food. Dad said crevice, mom said crevasse. Either way, you'd be surprised what people hide in there. Oh, wait a second. Beer bottle. Well, that could have been worse. Most of the maps lead to dead ends, but it sure beats a day job. At least that's what I hear. Frankly, I ain't got a choice. My food source is running slim and all. I can tell you this, when the world ends, there ain't much to do. So, I just follow the maps. This is how I live my apocalypse. Picked up a couple of folks along the way. Yeah, they saved my neck more than once. I guess I should trust them at some point. Getting attached ain't my thing. Man, this better not be another one of his wild goose chases. It's not another wild goose chase. At least I hope it's not another wild goose chase. What do you think it is, ammo? It's not ammo. Well, maybe it's a scattergun, then. It's not that. But it's gotta be ammo. That's the only thing people are trading for. Unless it's food. No, it's not that. It's something It's got old. an heirloom. Now, will the two of you shut up? That's it. It's an heirloom. Heirloom. It's up this way. We're gonna set up security. Another ominous place. Just once, I wish it would lead me somewhere easy.
is this? Stats, fertilizers, growing conditions, seeds. There are seeds in here. It's like a farmer's almanac for the apocalypse. This has got to be what that man was taught. Oh, crap. What you doing? Read a book. Everything here belongs to the Chancellor, including you. But it's a family. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. It's genuinely later. <laughs> I'm not losing you too. Get him out of here. It's an order. Cedric always talks that way. I think he was former military. Or maybe he was one of those prepper types. Either way, he took things really seriously and was right about his sit reps. Most of the time. This is home now. We built ourselves a town and everything. We even elected a mayor. Okay, so you want to explain to me? How it is, we roll in there with all this artillery, and you still get in a fist fight. That's how we're gonna spend our apocalypse, with Told You So McGee. So, morning. Morning, Beck. Beck got her house. Lulu got hitched. It all worked out, big brother. You just gotta trust me. A, I already do trust you, because I didn't shoot you. <laughs> B, maybe trying to die for that book wasn't so bad after all. Yeah. My feet are headed north My east is now my west Cause what Yo, hell was a small What's that thing called again? If faith is mine, I swear I'll damn these eyes It tear these bears and tell me what Panasonic.